do 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 Come on, Twitch, let's go. Now, now, birds. You're really gonna be giving me this problem already, Twitch. Oh, I take a break from the daily up, the daily streams, and you're like just being a jerk to me now? Well, the work week daily streams, anyway. Ah, there we go. Now you want to work. I see, I see. Well, hello, everybody, and good day to all, in the sense of I have returned to, as I said as I was complaining to Twitch, that I am now going to be continuing on with some uh, regular work week daily streams. And figured I would start off with some uh, Walking Dead. And, uh, yeah, I've got no real reason. Just figured it's spooky time. We could play a spooky game, even though it's not really that spooky. Let's go ahead and, uh, uh, continue my story, obviously. Claim AJ, Clem, AJ, and Jane then return to house where they took in a family. Uh, looking for shelter, I believe that's what I did. Alright, so this is a five episode one. I guess we'll be starting with episode one Ties That Bond Part One. Huh? Does this season have like episodes so long that they had to make it a two-parter in the first two that's weird okay well that's unusual but whatever when Javier and his family accidentally cross paths with a rival group a simple misunderstanding quickly spirals out of control all right so we've got a very much not Clementine based episode at the moment I do see Clem in episode four but this group definitely does not seem familiar. But let's go ahead and uh, just see how this goes. Adjust the slider so that the logo is barely visible. What logo? Oh. I guess this. And eh, this will make it a little bit easier for me. I'm 24 my eyesight's not as good as it used to be. <laughs> Series, the game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. I mean, how I play isn't much different from everybody else. It's really beyond the choices. But you know, whatever. Is that a phone? Hey. It's time. Get over here. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll start packing up. Now, Javi, you need to hurry. Look, I'm not giving you shit. Okay? I'm just... You weren't here when Dad was sick, okay? I get it, but... You need to fucking be here when he goes. I know. All right, I'm just on my way. <sighs> Interesting outline. That David, was a little unusual. David, hey. Hey, David. I had to leave my car. It's, traffic's just it's backed up for miles. He's dead. No, no, I, I, I tried. You're a piece of shit, you know that? One time, just the one goddamn time that you needed to be here. I tried, please, I tried. Oh, you tried, you fucking tried? Wow, dude, okay. Everyone's here. They've been here for days, and where the fuck were you? <clears throat> we're there all around him people who love him all around him and he's scared i'm seeing the panic in his eyes and he's searching the room donde esta javier donde esta mi hijo i'm there right beside him holding his hand like a good son and he doesn't even see me he doesn't even see me because he's looking for you 
You don't think there's a million places we'd rather be? You don't think we all had to make sacrifices? I'm sorry. Okay? David, Jesus, I... Sorry isn't bringing him back. You selfish fuck. What did I do? Why, why are you fighting? Your dad's an absolute you from jerk. Inside. What's going on? We were just, uh, talking, Gabriel. Right. Your uncle and I are just having a little chat. Go inside, mijo. We'll be in in a minute. God, I don't, don't like this guy already. It's okay. Inside. I should call someone, pick up the body. Yeah. I love you, little brother. You know that, right? With everything going on. Well, you got a pretty funny way of showing it. You think I was jealous of you? No, I, I don't think. No, anything. I just think you're a jerk. Well, I was for a long time. You've lost more than I'll ever have, but maybe something good can come out of all this. Cause we need you here. It's time to grow up. You can't run from this, not anymore. You want me around more? Fine. But goddamn, are you still one raging asshole? You know that. You can call me whatever you want. As long as you're here to do it to my face. Javi. Kate. I'm so sorry, Javi. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Let's go inside. Your mom needs you. What happened? Come on. Oh, okay. Got letterbox now. I have a feeling I have a feeling fight's going to happen. Mama. Where were you? What is up with this family? I tried. I tried. I'm so sorry. He's gone, mijo. He's gone. <laughs> He's in a better place, mama. God, I wasn't expecting you to be the mom. I didn't even get a prompt. Didn't realize I was gonna have to fight mom. That was weird. No puedo conectarme. Dicen que no hay servicio. Oh man, this is some serious opening credits right now. You thirsty, baby? You want some juice? Grandpa's cup was empty. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, God, her eyes scared the heck out of me. People's awake. Ooh. Ooh. Oh man, they're they're going full serious right now.
Rafa. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo es esto posible? Oh, man. Rip, rip you, dude. Soy yo, David. Estás en tu casa, estás cálmate. ¿Qué haciendo? Él está loco, él atacó a Héctor. Solamente está confundido. Mamá. Oh, mom, you're so dead. You're so dead. Rip your hand. Your hand's so torn. Oh, man. Oh, this is rough. Oh, my God. Oh, your cheek, lady. Oh, your poor cheek. You're gonna be okay. You'll be okay, mom. Help him. Help him. David. I'm sorry, Papa. We need to go. We need to get her to the hospital. Let me look at it. Let me look at it. Gabriel, where's your sister? <laughs> keys! Where the fuck are the keys? Take Dad's car. Keys are on the dash. Mama, get the kids. Meet at the hospital. Don't take the highway. It's blocked. I'll bring the van around. Where's Mari? I, I don't know. Mija. Mariana! From the stars. Mariana, we have to go. Yaya's hurt. Come on, honey. We have to go. No, no, no! No! It's okay. it's okay. County General Hospital. I know the way. Oh, Hector. Oh, man. Hector and Mama. Yo, rip. Rip the life. Why is it blue? Hector, do you have something you want to tell us? Why was your blood blue? <laughs> oh, and there are the Zambies. Say the Zambies. Present day. I wonder how long ago that was. This is gonna be present Tell day. Tell me it reaches the campfire. Man, I don't think I've seen this many. It's definitely growing. Yeah, not a great sign. Damn it, I left my water bottle. Her just got there. Just under four hours. Come on. We should keep moving while the kids are asleep. Yeah. Man, you gotta watch out for the, the gif of walkers coming at us. Looks like the herd is speeding up a little. I thought it was drifting southwest, but I'm not sure anymore. Every time I think we should just bed down somewhere and wait for it to pass, I can't shake the thought of us getting caught in the middle of it. It just keeps coming. It's slow, but that almost makes it worse. It makes it feel like we're in control. Hey, you're the one with the notebook. I leave that decision to you. Cool. <laughs> awesome. Because I was just using this thing to sketch in. Was I supposed to be writing something down? We'll figure it out. We always do. Hey, I'm gonna sneak a smoke. I can't believe you found weed. Are you kidding? People were probably growing this before they realized they needed food. Just, you know, make it quick. I don't want you waking the kids. We'll 
Relax. Mariana's got headphones on and Gabe is drooling. I think we're in the clear. You want some? Yo, I'll take yeah. a fat rip. Okay, sure. <coughs> we are setting an awesome example. <laughs> Don't judge me. <laughs> oh, when I found out David had kids, I told him I am not changing who I am around them. <laughs> and when he proposed, I reminded him that I'm not exactly stepmother material. <laughs> <laughs> Case in point. He was reassuring, but yeah, you know, I could tell he was worried about it. I knew he'd try to get me to change. <laughs> or at least he'd hope that being around the kids more would change me, you know? <laughs> I suppose it did. He was always stubborn like that. Even when we were kids. He saw the world in a certain way. And he'd try and make you see it that way, too. So that's where Gabe gets it from. I used to talk shit about all those mothers who'd go on about raising their kids being the hardest thing in the world. Oof. Gabe's making me start to think they had a point. <laughs> His mood swings are just... Oh, I don't know. Some days I just want to leave him by the side of the road. <laughs> I'm joking. Jesus. God, I'm gonna Obviously. be dealing with a moody teenage boy. Gabe's been emotional lately. I'm sure he's just, you know, going through a phase. Emotional? <laughs> right. That's cute. Look, I love these kids. But I could do without Gabe reminding me I'm not his mother whenever he's pissed. Man, he's a teenager. Puberty, hormones. Oh, yeah. The second you start getting boners, the whole world starts to get dark. <sighs> what are you talking about? It sounds delightful compared to dealing with bloody underwear. <laughs> Christ. I need to get laid. <laughs> <laughs> I realized that was an awkward transition. Sorry about that. You know, the kids can hear you. I just, no one wants to hear their parents talking about that. The stepmoms and uncles don't count. They're asleep. And besides, we're not really their parents. Still. Mm. Ugh. What's that smell? That's gross. Hey! Mariana, I... I think we uh, must have hit a skunk or something back there. I already know you guys do drugs. That's a pretty severe way of phrasing it, Mariana. Don't tell Gabe. He's the one who told me. Yeah, he's gonna oh. want it. Oh my god. Oh. You're even smoking in the car now? Alright. Everyone roll the windows down before you all get contact high. We're about to make a it's supply stop. Not as fun stop. as it sounds. As interesting as I'm sure it sounds, getting contact high is not really anything. It's just you're dealing with the smell. At least from my experience. Gasoline. You want a moment alone, Mari? I'm praying I find a candy bar. 
<laughs> All right. What do we actually need? Uh, a candy bar. Need, Mariana. Not want. You heard the crowd. Please, God, let there be candy bars. Amen. All right. Well, let's start with some gas and move up from there. <laughs> Oh, dang. Doesn't seem like you had an interesting time with the junkyard. Also, I love the fact that the hole that you should be having on the side of his face is completely gone. Oh, now his entire head is gone. That's a pretty good crowbar. Hey, where are you going? Okay, that's God, cool. God, I hate this kid. Have fun. Jesus. I hate this kid. It never ends with him. Dealing with moody teenage boys is like the like worst that. thing ever. I really hate it. It's like all Gabe wants to do is argue. It doesn't matter what it's about. Hey, I know that's what families do. They fight, they make up, and they fight all over again. At least you have your headphones. Yeah, but the batteries have been dead for a couple of weeks. I mostly <laughs> wear them to fool you guys. Well, when you put it that way, I wish I had a pair, too. You can borrow mine if you want. I might just have to do that. Be nice to find some dinner. In a junkyard. You never know. These past four years, people have been hoarding all kinds of shit in all kinds of places. All right, so four years. Oh, Good to know. Mari, if there's any trouble, you can find one of these cars. Yeah? Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. <laughs> wait as long as you can. Okay. Good girl. Alright, so I'm guessing Gabe is like 13, 14, and Mariana is like, I don't know, somewhere between 9 and 11. The, the age difference isn't that grand from what I can tell. So it's like, like at least... Nothing good left. Uh, Two, Someone picked it clean. maybe three years. Not that it really matters. I don't like Gabe. Gabe is a total just jerk, just like his dad. And tires. Let's go see what uh, Mariano wants to uh, say. Hey, any luck, kiddo? I need a pen. Or a pencil. Just... Something to write with. Yeah, I guess you are a little too old for crayons now. I guess so. Last <laughs> night I was thinking about this stupid story my mom used to tell me all the time before bed. I used to hate it. But... But then I realized I don't remember the ending. It was this goofy ending she thought was so funny and I thought was so dumb. I want to write down everything I can remember about everything. Because if I forget... And they're all gone? I'm kind of gone too. At least a little bit. I just think that might be kind of important. Maybe. That's a great idea, Mariana. Alright, so I gotta need to look out for a pen or pencil. I mean, I do like it. Waste oil. No use to us. Having a little bit of the past to remind you of who you are Most is a good thing. Most of the dashboard is torn out. Seats are gone. Ah, this thing's dead. At least they won't come back. Uh... Oh, that's gross. Okay, oh. now I'm sorry I did that. <clears throat> hey, it gave me an option to poke. Why wouldn't I poke? You find anything? I can't stop thinking about that herd. We get caught in it, and, and that's it. Peace, asshole. Can't charm your way out of that one. And we'd be gone in seconds. 
Okay, don't think about that. We're careful. We're smart. We'll stay ahead of them. <sighs> Luck runs out just as easily as gas. There's gonna be a last one, you know? A last tank of gas. Last piece of food. What if this place is empty? And, and the next? And the next? We're not gonna let that happen. Okay? <sighs> okay. I let it have its five minutes. I'm good. All right, well, I don't suppose you have a pen. Once this car made someone very happy. Now it sits here, rotting away. Así es la vida. That could hold a lot of gas. Could be really handy if we stayed for a while. All right, so it does say I can siphon there, so interesting. Acetylene. Handy for welding, but not much else. I wouldn't have minded having one of these back in the day. Ugh, I don't think these tires would fit the van. Sing the ladder. Yo, Gabe, you gonna help out? What's going on in there, buddy? I'm in a bad mood, okay? I want it to go away, but... It won't. I just wish we weren't always on the road. I like being with other people. It's just... We're in that car so damn long. The AC hasn't worked in ages. And it, it ain't my last damn tape. But we still got each other. It's better than nothing, right? I don't know. Maybe just leave me alone. Okay. But if you want to talk later, I'm... around. This one looks That's promising. relatable thing Gabe has said so far. It's the one time I've actually cared about Gabe's opinion right there. Alright, we good now? Can I get this gas jerk? Ugh, not much. But every bit helps. The fact that he had, like, pointed out that other one looked promising. Makes me feel like Papa. that there's something to go with. Go with it. Uh, okay, the thing went away. Barely anything. That was weird. I'll need to find more. Some sort of fuel tank. Empty. Nothing up there but garbage. Tires, paint cans, old newspaper. <sighs> All that's left in this junkyard is junk. Don't forget about yard. Too risky to search up there. Doesn't look stable. All right, let's go and siphon that other thing and then climb up there. Bingo. 
go. I guess that was a good one. Still haven't found that pen. Looks like there's more to see up here. I'm gonna do one last little search around. That, that was definitely like the whole uh, next sequence is gonna happen, so I'm like, probably should check to make sure everything's alright first. I talked to Gabe, I talked to Kate, and I talked to Marnie. Poke the bed. I haven't found the pen. Yeah, no, I guess I'm done. Alright, let's go ahead. Let us move forward and advance the story! We'll get there eventually, don't worry guys. Just, uh, you know. Human legs take a while, I guess. Don't have a jog or anything. Gotta save up that energy for when... The gif of Walker show up. Any luck? Some. But not enough. Gabe? Hey, Gabe. Let's go take a look over there. Gabe, stay close to Javi. Got it? Oh, all right. I wonder if I'm going to need a counter for how many times Gabe is going to be like, You're not my mom! <laughs> I'll give it a 0.5 for the... Uh, her technically saying it, but it's not full one since, you know, we didn't hear him say it. So, it's a point five at the hey, moment. Look. There's one they never took to pieces. Good catch. Hmm. Shit, locked. Still might be gas in the tank, though. Well, hang on. You're not getting any props nearby, and Gabe's gonna be all Shit. just it's locked. fidgety. All right, here goes nothing. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Look at all that fuel. This is going to take a while. All right, let's look around. I guess there's nothing to look at that way. Looks oh, pretty picked over. Pile. Still no pen, though. That's going to be my goal for this episode, is to find the stupid pen. Gabe, I swear, if you start using that gun, I'm going to be mad. Hmm. Took it like Looks a like champ. In there. Gabe, stay close. Gabe, I see that gun. I know you're going to use it and you're going to cause something stupid to happen. Ransacked a long time ago. Might be able to get in through the hatch. <laughs> Looks pretty run down. Locked. 
Yeah, let's uh, try to make less than a large amount of noise. Please be unlocked. Nice. That was surprisingly quiet for a metal trap door. Gabe, come check this out. Not the cleanest place. Oh, no more those at least. Just be careful. Place is decked out. Oh, look at this place. All right. Well, he, he seems to like it. Batteries. Double A's. I know someone will be happy to see these. Kidding me? Lucky for you, they put enough preservatives in this stuff to last for centuries. Well, there's enough food in here to keep us going for a long time. We survive on pudding cups. Oh, check it out. This is actual honest to God pudding. Seriously? And it's not just food. There's a mattress, there's blankets. Someone else's mattress someone else's blankets. We need to just take our gas and get on the road. This place does have a funny feeling about it. And if Muertos were to somehow surround us. Great, now I'm officially creeped out. Come on, one night. We bunk down, eat a real meal. It would be nice not to sleep in the van for a change. Please. The herd is coming if it's not here already. We should go and get ahead of it, before it's too late. The fence is reinforced. We'll be fine. We found this. Why can't we just enjoy it? Javi, can we? We could stretch out, sleep well for once? Come on, you know it's not a big deal. We've got guns. We can protect ourselves. We're gonna get what we came for and get out of here. Great. Another shitty cramp night in our shitty cramp van. Hooray. Come on, let's at least grab the food. You know, realistically, running into a house, essentially, with food, with minimal dead around. Oh, guess what? Uh, now, a little you can really drown us out. <laughs> and if we stay here, the people that live here are going to show up. Hey, thanks for that. Backing me up and all. How does it feel to be the bad guy this time? That must be a new <clears throat> sensation for you. I don't know. Oh boy, sleeping in the van again? <laughs> All I'll say is you definitely owe me one. <laughs> yeah, well, you owe me like a dozen, so I'll just shave it off your tab. Hey, Kate, can you come help us with this? Hey, uh, wait, but you... This way you can make up for being the bad guy. Thanks. Grab some gas. <laughs> We need to head out soon.
What the fuck do you think you're doing with our gas? Well, they've already Come shown on. up. Great. Speak up! I'm sorry, man. Look, it's just a can. We needed it really we? bad. I fucking knew it. There's more than just you out here. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I know you got people. They're out scouting around. But they'll be back soon. They're not gonna be too happy if they see you pointing a piece at me. Yeah, probably not. Then again, maybe they're already here. Waiting to make an ambush. Fan out, look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. Hey, you assholes in there. I got your You don't want them getting shot. You best come out there careful with your hands up. Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people. That shit's gonna make my day. Open it real slowly. Like you and your friends had a real feast, huh? Jeez, you can't dude, just, just take cup. what you like. I don't roll over like that. Look, we hardly took any. Uh, really, someone must have been here before us. Look, I, I, I get it, all right? You're starving. Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling. <clears throat> that you're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. Keep an eye on this dickhead. I'm gonna grab some cuffs. You got it. Just chill, okay? No need to make this any harder. Look, your buddy's not thinking straight. So let's talk, okay? You and me, we can get this sorted out. No, it's his call. Look, man, this doesn't have to go. The fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. You don't want me finding out for myself. Come on, man, what else? There are muertos down there. There were a bunch of them outside, too. The dead, huh? Well, then, we better take care of that, shouldn't we? Sorry about this, man. You seem kind of cool. Holy shit! You have to pay for what you've done here. Wait, 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 wait! Don't you? I mean, you didn't shoot, so. Oh god, wow. It's... Dang, this is gonna be a long episode if this was only chapter... If that was the end of chapter two. <gasps> hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Fucking asshole. Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back then. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. You have to go back. My family's back there. Hey, you gotta listen to me. There's a herd coming. 
A massive one. And yeah, we... and that's why we're driving away from it. Please, just... Stop, all right? You don't want me riled up, kid. Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the hell? Stop! Stop! Ah, shit! No, no, no! Alrighty, well. Ooh, a gun. Just keep looking forward. Oh, snap. Look, I'm no threat to you, okay? I surrender. Well, that's obvious. Seeing how you didn't shoot that guy. Okay. Yo, now Clem is strapped. Because I'm not as nice as you. I won't hesitate. You're a kid. Well, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Oh, shit. What do you need the truck for? To drive. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me. This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522 and, and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard if you let me have your van. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. That van is our home. It's all we got. That sounds like a no. How about you just give me directions like a normal person? How about I shoot you and take the van anyway? This is a better deal for you. Let's go. This really necessary? Oh man, Clem is ruthless. I don't know you, I don't trust you, and I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. Look, I get it. You're being cautious. Glad we understand each other. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Well, thanks for not killing me, Clementine. Don't thank me yet. No, that was a short chapter. Oh man, I was so strong that he started bleeding before he he was stabbed. Look, 
You don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. Now, come on. This whole silent loner thing you got going on? Just be real with me. I don't know what you're talking about. Muertos. The herd caught up with us. Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Usually, it's just me on my own. Apology accepted. I wasn't apologizing. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm loving this dynamic between these so, two that it's making. Who's that's at making this junkyard? Deal with. My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive. Surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. Well, I didn't do it alone. My, uh, well, uh, Kate helped. She did most of the work, actually. Sounds nice, having a partner. It is. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was, but some people looked out for me, too. What happened to them? Same thing Same that thing happens, that happens to, to everyone. everyone. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Can you do that, please? Fine. Whatever you say. Thank you. Don't make me regret this. Come on! Don't know why the yell was necessary. We could have just, you know, got moving. All right. Yeah, I'm liking this little snarky back and forth between these two that I'm unintentionally picking. <laughs> it's very there. entertaining. Get to the gate! Just keep going! They'll open up! Shit! Hey! Open up! Can't open the gate till you clear them out. You can't risk it. Oh, you look cool. Kind of like a bit like a Geralt from a uh, Witcher. Just not as rugged. Fuck! These bullets won't fire. <laughs> Inside. Come on now. Yeah, you're like Geralt if he had a dad bod. God effing damn it, Francine. One of these days, those doors are gonna close and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. <laughs> it's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind if you want to hang on to all your teeth, that is. Now head on in. I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. Seems, uh... 
Hmm. Not quite sure. It's a pretty cool place, word for actually. This place so far. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Usually, I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. Hey, what's the problem? You have some sort of history here that I should know about? Not really. I just... I know what people are capable of. Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... they'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well, you know, it's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? <clears throat> Looks like someone's in the middle of a game. Well, he's not going anywhere. Looks like we got an arcade machine out of order. I wonder where they found this old thing. I haven't seen one of these in years. Phantom Punch! Chess. Not really my game. I think Gabe used to play, though. Wow, I have a sudden dislike for chess. Wonder if it's loaded. I would assume so. Play your hand. You're gonna lose, but you don't have to do it in slow motion. Don't try and rush me. <laughs> I know your game. This is my game. Clearly. Always a smart ass. Well, it ain't gonna work. They seem Excuse nice. Me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves, I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20-year career. The way I see it. Nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. <laughs> and that got a lifetime ban? Honestly, I don't even think about it anymore. Past is the past. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call, or should I fold? Hmm, don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. Though all it takes is one good hand. He's bluffing. He's got bullshit written all over <laughs> Is that a fact? All right, I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip him. Oh my, ain't that a pretty sight? Good looking hand there, but not good looking enough. God damn it. Shit, sorry. And thanks for playing. Let me get you a drink <laughs> for the assist. On the house. Bottoms up. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Oh boy. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal, and it's done. 
What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Because I don't scare easy, all right? She doesn't need a bodyguard. She can take care of herself. Believe me. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. Unfucking believable. Look out! Well, this is not going well. Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy. I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus. You gotta get her under control, man. This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her. Which looks like bad news for you. We had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Drop the gun! Right now! Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You've done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... Ch what the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Look at Dude my was a jerk. Man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do Whoa. with you. Oh, hey, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. You got some nerve coming in here fucking up my bar. I mean, while I did lie, he did also attack me. So it wasn't a full lie. I'm gonna punch your fucking lights out. Both of you. But Eli was a grade-A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Hey. Thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um... That was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. Of course. Anytime. Hell, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Hello? I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. The trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage, like you're some feral animal. Javier, pleasure's all mine. Is it now? Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks <clears throat> equal bad behavior or something. <sighs> I've never understood it. Are you calling me pretty? <laughs> I was talking about Eli, the dead guy. Oh, yeah, good. Because I prefer dashing. Or debonair, maybe. Yeah, I'll try to keep that in mind. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? That guy had it coming. Believe me. Karma, justice, you call it whatever you want. Fuck that bastard. Hey, okay. If you say so. 
Best thing is probably for you two to leave town and get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help. Well, not that I have much to offer you, but... I know a thing or two about losing family. Hey, it's okay. You've done enough. I hear you, but... Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? All right, fair enough. Fair enough? Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they could need a medic. Nuh-uh, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but, well, we could leave tonight. Slip past the herd. Get a jump start on reaching that junkyard? It's too risky. And if Muertos were to somehow surround us, we... Don't worry. It'll be fine. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had a dinner. Yeah. She's... She's something. The thing is, is and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. Hmm. You're right. Trip's got more muscle, just in case. We'll wait and get a ride with him. Glad you're finally listening to reason. You know, I've been literally on your side this I whole you'd just time. Be like an asshole like everyone else. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. It's gonna be a while before that herd passes. We might as well get some sleep. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. Clem, I care about you, but you're being very unusual. It's like, oh, you're listening to reason now. It's like, I've been on your side this whole time for the past, like, 30 minutes. It kind of hurts. I'm sorry. I know it sucks. I'm... I haven't been sleeping well lately. I've noticed. So many people died here. So many ghosts. Sometimes they're all I think about. Especially during the night. Ghosts don't scare me. They don't have teeth. Or guns. Yeah. I guess. Hey, look, Goofball. It's you. Alvin Goofball Jr. Can you say Goofball? You know, he does need a middle name. His parents, they never got a chance. You think? Go on. Pick one. No time like the present. Mm -hmm. How about Luke? I I'm... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine. Luke. Sure, whatever. I was just thinking Jamie was pretty cool. For a boy or a girl. Jamie? That was your sister? Yeah. I used to think that if I was ever... picking out names, I'd... Anyway, the deal was ink first, then a perimeter sweep. 
but I just checked it a few days ago. We're on our own here, Clem. And after that asshole family we let in made off with half our food, we can't take any more chances. It won't take long. They seem nice. Nice enough. Nice people get hungry, too. And then suddenly, they're not so nice anymore. So get to it. I want you to be prepared. For anything. I know. I'm gonna go take a little nap. I'm, uh... Not feeling that great. I don't like this. Jane? If you're not feeling well, I can bring you something. Oh my god! Oh god! Well, I guess that's how Jane's story ended. I'm not gonna lie, I actually kind of hate Jane right now. Yeah, she she killed herself and it's like, uh, you're supposed to feel bad for her because you chose to have her survive, but she literally hung herself! Like, oh, I don't want to bring a child into this world. Like, I, I hey, get Clint. that, but all things considered, but jeez. Hey, Clem. That is an yeah, absolute garbage way for that character say, to have I gone hope out. I people are safe and sound. Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it. Oh, yeah? Yes, sir. So that's what I'm going to do. So why she went to bat for you, I've got no idea. I mean, she hardly even knows you. And you don't know her, for that matter. Makes a guy wonder, you know? You know there's not much mystery to a trip. She's a good human being. Yeah. Eleanor's got a big heart. That's for damn sure. Trip's Guys, beard bothers me on the sides. The Like, you can see, what like, his jawline just completely shaved, but he still has that beard up there. That just looks weird to me. It, you can't really see it too well now, but when he was driving, Jesus. you saw the side of his head. Must it was have been hundreds of very them. clear. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? Tape player. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god! Oh, I thank see. goodness you're alive. I can't believe it. 
you told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. I don't even know how long I was in there. Then I heard your voice. I thought I was hallucinating at first. I'm so sorry I left you behind. I've been trying to get back here this whole time. You don't have to be sorry. You said you'd come back, and you did. Kate, and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were gonna try to make it back to the van. Then that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh no. The van's not looking too good. No. No sign of him. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. They're trapped in there. Mariana, stay back. Time to save the day. Nice. Javi, you found us. Hey, hey, it's okay. Ooh. I got you. You happy to see me? I'm happy to see all of you. Happy you're all okay. Another couple of minutes, we might not have been. But then, you showed up. Just when it really mattered. Yeah, well, that's kind of my thing. <laughs> I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. I thought we were done for. You're still alive, aren't you? So is Kate. So is Mari. That's all that matters. I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Well, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. As soon as we get back to Prescott, She'll patch you right up. I'm Trip, by the way. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? Clementine's a friend. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god, Javi, do they have hot water? Even like <laughs> lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? Eh, don't get your hopes up too high. It's a nice place, but it's not the Ritz. Well, whatever they've got, I'm sure it's gonna be great. Between you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. But you found every single one of your people. And you found them alive, healthy, Reasonably cheerful. It's a hell of a thing. Well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I don't want to jinx us. Well, some things are worth saying woo-hoo about, that's all. When we get yeah, back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. I was hoping you might stay. You know, considering... Considering what? You came all the way out here with me. Yeah, for the van, not for... Cool. Oh, hey, your little headphones. Thanks.
think so. Javi, we can't leave her. Oh, shit. Oh. Kate. <laughs> Stop. Uh. Stop. <laughs> I know, Harvey, and there'll be time for all that, but not right now. Kate needs a doctor. <laughs> Which means we gotta go. We got a window here, man. We gotta get a move on before they start shooting again. I can't leave her like this. I won't. You wanna die too? You think that's gonna help your little girl? Then get the fuck up and help me. It's time to go, man. Stay here and we finish this. Are you fucking nuts? We gotta get the fuck out of here I've right now. I already killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Trip help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please. Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi, please come with us. Please. Javi, come on. Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi. Go with them. I'll be fine. Give me a hand here, kid. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. Javi, don't! I guess this just completely doesn't work now because of the whole telltale thing. That's great. But... Oh, man. I, uh... I don't know what to say. I really don't. <sighs> I guess all I can say is I'll get back to this tomorrow part two and that I am genuinely upset that Marnie is dead or Mari is dead that is a uh, I I don't have anything I can say Thanks for watching, YouTube people on there. Thanks for watching. Be sure to follow me on Twitch. Subscribe on my YouTube. You can follow me on Twitter. I'll be back to this again tomorrow around like 2.30, uh, 2.30 p.m. Eastern.
and uh, that's it. Later, guys.